I'm sure you have all seen Frogan or Frog Anne. I'm not sure what you'd call her. She does look like a frog. Features in all cheeks. Probably got frog-like ears and a long-ass tongue, similar to a snake. She is uh, a Twitch partner. She uh, is a bitch. And someone I can't wait to uh, talk about. Because she is a nasty cunt who said that people should basically suffer from PTSD if they're an American soldier. I have no pity at all for any fucking soldiers. Distress, thank you so much. I will never have any fucking pity for any fucking soldiers. U.S. military? Who fucking who? I hope you get PTSD. God. You know, everyone can eat what they want, but I feel like, you know, when you're talking about people who are dead, PTSD, in order for not people to rinse you and you're in, like, what is she wearing? Like, is that a religious thing? Because I'm not sure that doesn't sound very religious to me, does it? Saying that she wishes all these pe they have PTSD, she doesn't care about them. She couldn't give a shit about soldiers. She's living in a country that they fought for. You know what I mean? Why don't she fuck off? Whoa. Whoa. Could imagine. I don't like living here. Leave. God, does she ever stop eating? I'm going to be mean. I'm sorry. I hate her. Honestly, I hope she gets run over by a truck. I, I do. The ones I do. I, the ones I'm like, whatever about the U.S. soldiers. Are the ones that like acknowledge that like what they did was wrong they didn't know well back they didn't know back then whatever you're you're a good person in my book oh my god tom thank you so much for the 10 gifted the, the the u.s military that are like yeah like you know i did this back then but now i know it's wrong like i'm changed like fuck imperialism fuck this you don't deserve the ptsd but like any other motherfucker you're joining them you, or you're like, oh my god i want my fucking camaro no student loans fuck you i hope you get PTSD. So she hopes they get PTSD because, you know, some reason she doesn't like them. So usually when people say dumb shit, they then apologise. They go, oh, I didn't mean it. I, I wasn't thinking. I, I, it slipped out of my mouth. I was joking. I pretend. I pretend. Not this bitch, no. God, she's still eating. <laughs> Fuck. She's like a, like a giddy hamster who's being bought for the first day by a six-year-old. I mean, who, who? That's what she fucking sounds like. You fucking pig! And they posted it in my head. I'm like, ah, uh, base? Ah, uh, base? <laughs> she fucking joking. Like, am I supposed to be? Am I supposed to be like, like, I'm not walking back on it. I still fucking agree with it. Ah, uh, base? Any other motherfucker, you're joining them. You're like, oh my god, I want me. So she still agrees with it, uh, which is fine. You know what I mean? Better to be confident. And at least say what you believe, you know, I'm just glad she got, you know, I should probably have said that five seconds ago. She got banned and she got a 30 day ban. So we'd have to see a fucking ugly ass foam head for that long. And then she did this, apologize. And as they say, uh, she initially doubled down and said she base. Base? The US military has conducted some of the most horrific crimes against humanity. Bah, 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 bah. In, as in Iraq, Afghanistan, Syria, Lebanon, Palestine, Manga is directed at individuals who are currently championing these war crimes as if they are liberated, my people. It's horrific and disgusting. In the beginning of the clip was worded poorly. I do apologize for that. I'm going to clarify the clip. I do not mean all military, but those specifically with no remorse. What I said was out of frustration as they are currently bombing my family in the name of liberation. I realize that. Um, what the sigma? So that's really comfy. She was laughing, joking. Base? <laughs> this is fucking hilarious. <laughs> but her family's getting bombed. Why do you go help them out? Instead of eating your fucking Uber Eats all day, how about you go assist them? Ooh. I realise that Wishing People Arm isn't the best way to talk about these issues and that I could have talked about these topics in a more sensitive way. That's a pathetic apology. Zero out of ten. Rubbish. I've seen better apologies from a 12-year-old kid. And then just confirm, 30-day ban for saying people like bottom of the bow are humans, but other people get two weeks for advocating for the genocide of Palestinians. Got it. And then, I don't know who any of these are really. I've heard of this guy. I know the Capri Sun fella. Um, but they've all been banned. This is a targeted assault. This is... Precision drone strikes have taken out almost all mid-level leadership in Twitch's anti-Semitic politics. So apparently these guys all hate Jews. Um, I don't think that's true. I'll be honest. I just think they don't like Israel. I, I guess that's what they're, they're talking about. Here's a little family tree, just so you can all see. I mean, look at that. Four have been taken out. I have to admit, I really don't like Hassan. I think he's, like, 
insufferable. You know, there's no different like to him than someone on the far right. You know, socialism is like wrong. You know, he's a, he's he's rich. He doesn't give a fuck about you, and he's he's almost like preaching like he's Jesus who's got nothing, and you know, is trying to save the world. He's an absolute hypocrite fart. Boom. I mean, oh, I I I can't I can't stand it. I I can't stand him. I can't like. I don't even know what he talks about. Just looking at his face makes me want to just get a shotgun and just fucking go, fucking you know. They all got banned. This is something else that Hassan actually tweeted, believe it or not. The actual report findings show something very different from the way this is new UN report is being represented. So he's basically saying that on the October 7 attacks last year that no one was raped, basically. There's no evidence for it. Like, bro, were you fucking there? Did you sit behind with a camera filming it for porn? No, you fucking didn't. You don't know what's going on. And that's why I can't stand this guy. He has no idea what's going on and thinks he's a fucking genius. Look, there's been a lot about Jews, Palestine, Muslim, you know, whatever it is. I'm so sick of this. I just, you know, fucking dogs like, shut the fuck up. Do you mind not blowing each other up for one fucking minute? One fucking minute, mate. Then they made this clip. Now, my God. So two multimillionaires sit in a multi-million dollar West Hollywood house tell Ethan that he shouldn't get worked up about anti-Semitism because he's rich. I think like anyone who does our general job, and especially someone like him who I only make $3 million a month. <laughs> I'm middle class. He makes $30 million a month. He's Upper middle class. He's upper middle class. He's and these it's... fucking lefty fucking wankers. Shut the... He's upper middle class. Bro, he's a YouTuber. Just because you're a YouTuber does not mean you've grown up, like, with this money. Like, it's fucking... Like, you two are sat there multi-millionaires. You're a fucking doorknob that needs your head turning. Like, holy shit. Oh, he's upper middle class. You sound like a pompy right fucking cunt who deserves a fucking teabag. Like, that shit pisses me off. Like... Bro, you are the same, you're in the same boat. It's same boat, you're just not a Jew Jewish. Like, we won the lottery. Why are you bitching about the... Tr this motherfucker says you are rich, so why do you care about anti-Semitism? Also, like, Hassan is fucking, as, as ri like, probably as rich as I am, let's be honest. He downplays as well. He, he exactly, he has so much fucking money as well. Like, you don't understand, this guy is absolutely draining the balls of his audience so much. But yeah, look, this is a civil war against people. Someone commented on my tweet and fucking... Anyway, one thing I did want to just play. Now, I don't promote this, but Aiden Ross has obviously made a comment on the situation because he owns streaming, because he... I speak for what's right. This is wrong, okay? This is fucking wrong to say that U.S. soldiers who fight every single day for America to say they deserve PTSD. This girl's a terrorist. Get her out of America. Who owns? Fuck you. Oh, Listen you. to shit. Any other motherfucker, you're joining them. You, you're like, oh my god, I want my fucking Camaro. No, who owns? Fuck you. I hope you get PTSD. <laughs> Stuff your face, you, you fat pig. <laughs> See, I feel bad because now Adam Ross is calling her what I was calling her. You know what I mean? Like, but she's, she's disgusting. You know what I mean? I hope she gets fucking punished for it. Deport her. I think that'll be funny. Go send her to where the rest of her family is. You know what I mean? If you don't like Pete, if you don't like the soldiers who were protecting you, leave. You know, if you insult the soldiers that have look after you and fight for what your country, or whatever. Yeah, I know. There's dod. America has been dodgy for two hundred years. All right, just because you finally caught on. Oh, 